Welcome to Excel Magic Trick number 710. Hey, if you want to download this workbook and follow along, click on my YouTube channel, then click on my College website link, and you can download the workbook, Excel Magic Trick 707 to 710. Hey, here we have a data set, site, speciality, theater, and uh, operating minutes. And we need to average with three criteria. But the problem is, this is just a little data set. What if this is a huge data set and you don't know all of the combinations? Because we need to list. Notice it says HH Cardiac Theater 2, uh, HH Cardiac Theater 2. We need to list this only one time. So we, in essence, need to extract the unique list. Now, this is the ridiculous way to do it. You actually uh, create an extra column. And then you do a ridiculous formula like this for counting unique based on this. And then you do a formula to extract all the individual columns only when there's a unique occurrence of it. And then you do an average. That's all ridiculous because a pivot table can do it in just a few clicks. Let's see how to do this. In uh, 2007 and 10, you do Alt N V T. Alt NVT. In earlier versions, you do Alt DPF. And then uh, I'm going to hit Enter, and it puts a new pivot table on a sheet. All you got to do is drag. This is pretty scrunched up. But you drag all three uh, of these criteria to the label, to the row area, right? The operating minutes to the values. And instantly, you have a sum given the three criteria, uh, theater 2, cardiac H, uh, renal, and then these two. So the, the final calculation here, not in bold, is that sum with three criteria. But we need an average, so you simply right click, right click, value field settings, and change it to an average. It'll even change the label. Just like that. Totally amazing. Now, uh, we're interested in only these values right here. Um, but boy, is that simple compared to uh, you know doing some array formula methods like that. So two important things. One is it's easy to do average by changing the uh, function there. But what was really cool is it lists in a, a unique occurrence uh, given three criteria. And there's the calculation. All right, we'll see you next trick.